Hello Techies! In the upcoming tutorials, we will learn about vision actions which are available under Google Cognitive Service in Power Automate Desktop. These actions allow developers easily to integrate vision detection features within applications including image labeling, face, logo and landmark detection, optical character recognition, OCR, and detection of explicit content into applications. If you see on my screen, we are having vision actions under cognitive services, which are available for the Google Cloud Platform. There you can see label detection, landmark detection action, test detection action, logo detection, image properties detection, and finally we have save search detection. These actions can be performed by using Cloud Vision API. How can we go ahead and get it, the Cloud Vision API? To get this Cloud Vision API, we need to sign in into the Google Cloud Platform. There you can see, I have already logged in into the cloud.google.com. There you can see my Google Cloud Platform. In our previous sessions to work with natural language, we have created the API which are related to the cloud natural language API. In the same way, here to work with vision actions which are available under the Google section, there I'm going to use cloud vision API. How can we go ahead and get it? There I'm going to search for cloud vision API. There you can see I'm having the API for the cloud vision API. Click on that. Now, previously this will be in enable state so that I'm going to click on enable so that I can go ahead and I can get the features of Cloud Vision API where it will integrate Google Vision features such as image labeling, face, logo and landmark detection. Along with that we can have OCR that is optical character recognition and detection of explicit content in our applications. All right. Now I'm going to click on manage. There you can see I'm having Cloud Vision API, which is available under APIs and services. All right, to create the credentials or the APIs related to the Cloud Vision API, click on create credentials over here. There to work with all these vision actions, which are available under the cognitive services related to the Google, we required the API key, which are related to the Cloud Vision API. Let me drag and drop any one of the action onto the workspace. There you can see I required the API key. Now let's go back to the Cloud Vision API service. There you can see I'm having credentials. Click on that. This Cloud Vision API key is same for Cloud Natural along with API key. We can copy the same thing or if you want to create separate API keys for the natural along with API as well as vision API, in that case, you are going to create credentials over there and then you are going to select API key. I have created a new API key for Cloud Vision API. All right, let's click on close. Now, this API key I'm going to use across the vision actions which are available under the Google cognitive services. If you see for these actions, that is vision actions, I'm going to use that API key, which I'm going to explain in the next tutorial. I hope you understand how to create cloud vision API key and also the purpose of vision actions as part of this tutorial. Thank you for watching Power Automate tutorials. If you have any queries related to this concept, please post them in the comment section. I will see you in the next session. Till then, bye-bye. Have a wonderful day.